what is going on guys welcome back to another video so now i have a lot of apple products and it might be a problem but anyway in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys exactly how many apple products i have which ones how they work i'm going to be re-unboxing all of them um it's going to be a pretty crazy video so thank you guys for watching this video um if you did make sure to like and subscribe don't forget to comment down your favorite song that i made back then right you know the auto ones. but anyway let's just get right into it So starting off, we have the Lightning to USB 3 camera adapter. Now this one is not really that important anymore because I had originally gotten it to use with my microphone on my phone. Because as you guys know, iPhones have Lightning and not USB-C. So moving on, we have the Apple Magic Keyboard. Now this is a really, really nice keyboard. I really love how it types. Um, probably not a gamer keyboard, I would say. Definitely more of a productivity keyboard, like for working. Let's get this nice ASMR clip ready. Oh my god, that sounds so satisfying. But that's pretty much it here. Um, it obviously works better with a Mac because it is made for a Mac, but you can really use this keyboard with any other computer because it's Bluetooth, but like I said, it works better with a Mac. So moving on, we have the iPhone leather wallet and the iPhone battery pack. Now these are very nice unboxings, well, like any Apple product really. And these are pretty cool. What these do is they actually attach to the back of your phone with a magnet and you could do many things with them. Obviously, with the wallet you can store credit cards and the battery pack, it'll charge your phone. These are one of the best iPhone products like, in the world. So moving on, we have the iPhone 13 silicone case and the iPhone 13 clear case. Now, for the record, blue is my favorite color. You'll see that later. And now look at this color of the case. It is absolutely amazing. When I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, give me this. Look at that beautiful color there. I'm not gonna take it out of the case because it's a little scratched from, uh, I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but yeah, it's a little scratched as you can see there. But um, anyway, that's it. And the clear case I actually got because the iPhone 13 color is amazing and I just wanna see it. Obviously the clear case is a little more plain um, and more rigid, but still it's amazing because it shows the iPhone 13's color. And that is pretty much it. So moving on to the next one, we have the MagSafe Duo Charger. Now, this is a really, really great charger. It's the best one I've ever purchased, honestly. Now, what I like about this is that you can literally charge two of your devices, as long as they include MagSafe, at the same time. Now, charging speeds may depend on whatever charging cable you're using, but honestly, it's a great bedside charger to use because whether you're not using a 30 watt charger or a 10 watt charger, you're still gonna have 100% in both your devices by the morning. So now moving on to the next one is one of my favorite items, the HomePod Mini. Now, this is basically an Apple made Alexa, if you will. And what allows this to be so good is that it's all like in the Apple ecosystem. So what that means is basically you start something on your phone, it'll continue on the HomePod. Like if you're playing music, you can automatically switch and it's just so nice how it switches. Um, you get that power brick there, so you can plug it into the wall. I don't think it works with any other power brick. I think it just works with a 20 watt, but that doesn't really matter. Now, what this HomePod does is it basically is a smart home hub for your smart home accessories if you have any. So like, if you have any LED lights or just regular lights, you can ask Siri to turn on the lights, um, tell Siri to play music, send a message, all that stuff. It's basically like an Alexa, like I said, but made by Apple. It's a really good device. I definitely recommend buying it. The normal HomePod is actually $300, whereas this one is only $100, so definitely a better choice. Obviously, I love the blue here. You kind of see the theme going here. But going on to the next one, we have the iPhone, which is one of the most important devices in my life. I'm actually using it to record right now, which is why it's not in the box. I also, you know, vandalized the box a little bit with some blue sharpie but um we're not going to talk about that <laughs> but anyway the iphone is one of the most important devices in my life i use it almost every day as long as i don't get in trouble and lose it but yeah this is the iphone 13 in blue i absolutely love this color again with the blue you kind of see the blue theme going here but now um i love the iphone it is absolutely amazing definitely like a very important device like i said and it just allows me to do so many things like the integration is just absolutely amazing so now going on to one of them I missed are the AirTags. Now, AirTags aren't that important, but if you lose things frequently, they might be. 
Now, air tags are basically trackers that you put in something like a wallet or a backpack or a lunchbox or whatever you can fit it into. And what it basically does, it, it tracks it, right? So you can look at the Find My app and you will see where it is at all times. Even if it's with you, you'll still always know where it is. Going on to the next one is one of my most favorite ones is the AirPods Pro 2. You can just call this AirPods Pro. Now, these are one of Apple's newest earbuds. Uh, they released last year, or 2022 September event, which is basically last year. Now, the reason I love these so much is that it has noise cancellation like nothing else. It is so good at how it removes background noise. I absolutely love it. It has spatial audio, Dolby Atmos, transparency mode, all of that stuff. It's just so good. And I got them engraved, so, you know, you know it's mine. And what's another cool feature is that you can actually switch the ear tips because they give you an extra one from the back. And you may notice that I'm missing one because uh, someone <coughs> threw it out of the bus window. I'll get to that later. But now going on to another pair of AirPods is the AirPods Max. Now I don't definitely use these all the time as I would use the AirPods Pro, but another great pair of headphones made by Apple. These are absolutely amazing. Again, you see the blue color here. I love blue. <laughs> you cannot like deny that. Now out of the box, they look amazing. Um, presented really nicely in this smart folio case that apparently puts it into a low power mode. Honestly, I never got that. Like, I don't really care, but like, anyway, look at them. They're so good. They look so premium. A nice premium feel to it. They look amazing. And noise cancellation on these are actually really, really good, even though they're made in 2020. So hopefully they make an updated version, but you know, Apple does what Apple does. And another feature on these is transparency mode, like always, and spatial audio with Dolby Atmos, like on the AirPods Pro. Now, I love this because the mesh band at the top basically makes it feel like there's nothing on your head, hence the name AirPods. All right, next one. So going on to the next one, I use this every day, is the Apple Watch. Now, this is the Apple Watch Series 8, again, released at the September event in 2022. Um, another great watch, it has Honestly, too much features that I barely use anyway. You're going to notice I kept the silicon or whatever it's called thing there that covers it when you get out of the box. But I'm actually wearing it right now, as you can see here. The always on display is one of the best features, actually, because I know I see I didn't have it. But I love this watch. It's amazing. Like I said, too many health features that I don't even use because I'm under 18. But anyway, I definitely recommend purchasing it. It is a great watch, like I said before. But obviously, if it's a little too expensive for you, you can always get the SE, which is a lot cheaper. And yeah, they're great watches. So going into the next one, we have the most important one in my life ever. It is the MacBook Pro. Now, I had got this recently. It has also came out recently at the October Scary Fest event. Now, this Mac has completely transformed my life. You have no idea. And it is just amazing. Much, much better than using my Acer Chromebook 511 that school gave me, but you know. Again, really good computer, much, much better. The RAM, the RAM is very disappointing. The fact that Apple made an eight gigabyte RAM computer is just wrong. Um, I definitely should have gone with the M3 Pro, but again, it's much, much better. It's a big upgrade from what I have. I have so much apps on this. This is what allows me to stream, record videos, edit them. Oh my God, it's just amazing. I love this computer. So if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to like and subscribe. Obviously, I have a ton of Apple products, maybe too much. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Don't forget to comment on your favorite song I made back then. So I'll look back and embarrass myself again. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching the video, and I will see you in the next one.